Hi kids, it's Miss Stacy. I'm here on the balcony at my house. I wanna show you my pepper plant. My neighbor, Mike, who has a big, beautiful backyard garden, he did so many plants and he gave me a pepper plant. So I put it in a pot on my balcony. And I'll also show you my other plants. Here's my little balcony garden. Now out here in my backyard, that's my neighbor Mike's garden. He's growing a lot of tomatoes. Inside that cage, he's growing watermelons. He has to keep them in a cage so that the squirrels don't eat them. He gave me this pepper plant and I planted it in this pot and it got big. It's, it's tallest leaf is up to here, so it's not quite as tall as my balcony railing yet, but it's getting bigger. Now this plant is catnip, and my cat Percy loves to eat catnip. This plant is cilantro, but it doesn't, it doesn't work for fresh cilantro anymore, but you see these little pods? I think there's a different spice inside these pods. Um, I forgot what it's called. But it's a little wilted. <clears throat> okay, but here's my pepper plant. Do you see my pepper? There it is. So the pepper is going to get bigger and it's going to turn red because it's a red bell pepper. It's green right now because it's not ripe. I think if I wanted to eat it right now, I could pick it and cut it up and eat it and it would still be good, but I'm going to wait till it gets bigger. There's my biggest pepper over here is another pepper. Are there any more? Oh, there's a, a little flower. Okay, so I think my pepper plant really only has the two peppers. One, two. I'm excited for them to get ripe. I'm gonna eat them and enjoy them. Three weeks later, a pepper update. I have an update about my pepper plant. They are red bell peppers, but when I showed you before, the two peppers that are growing on it were green. Well, one of them is turning red. Let's have a look. There they are, my two peppers. Here's the one that's turning red. I had to I had to tie the plant to my railing so that it wouldn't be damaged by the windstorm that we had. So that's why I, I have uh, shoelaces tied on the plant. Oh, and this big old stick. The stick is to help it stand up too. All right, kids, thanks for Looking at my video. Bye-bye.